Today I'm doing everything in 10 times speed for 24 hours. Let's start. I woke up and jumped out of the bed. I did my routine as fast as I could. Maybe a bit less effective, but fast. I was about to leave for school when I realized that I actually have some extra free time. Weird. So I got some extra time to relax a bit before school and then I left. Honestly, school is not that interesting, so I'm just gonna skip that part. When I came back, I changed clothes fast, I ate the food fast, and then I got to work. Now what about work? I probably shouldn't be doing that too fast, right? It's important to do it well, not fast, right? Wrong. Kind of. One of the things that I learned from pirating Hustlers University is that speed is everything. So whatever your work is, whether it's studying, whether it's actual work and actual business, I'm not saying to do it poorly, but figure out ways how you can pull off the best possible quality in as little possible time. That would probably mean less distractions, so put your phone away, probably no breaks every five minutes, probably not being lazy, and finding ideas how to maximize your workflow. After I was done with work, I had to shower. Now who doesn't like to get into a hot bath and lay in there for half an hour oh well cold shower it is done in two minutes time for dinner proceeds to cook 10 minute rice in one minute jokes aside you can cook and eat faster if you do it without watching a video alongside it and i know yeah it's more enjoyable to do it that way yeah you go onto youtube and you look for the perfect video for longer than you will actually eat the food but what do you prioritize right now enjoyment or speed because watch till the end of this video and you will realize that prioritizing speed can actually bring you more enjoyment ironically okay so i have to wash the dishes real fast right now but let, let's pause that for a second the point of this video is not to do everything faster to the point that it loses quality the point of this video is to just do all these little chores faster so that you can then create more time in your day for more important things or even just to relax a bit but but these little chores are not worth spending a lot of time on and i'm also not saying to become a robot who only does things in 10 times speed but Find a good balance of doing things fast, but also doing them good enough so it's not completely terrible, so that then you can use it for the most practical extent for yourself. Right, now I actually have to wash these dishes, so yeah. So at the end of the day, I actually realized that now I have a bunch of free time that I didn't have before, just by doing things faster, which often just means less distractions so while you're doing a chore don't watch something at the same time but focus on the thing that you're doing so you can do it faster and by doing that you will have more time at the end of the day to focus on the things that are more fun and more enjoyable which i think is better than watching something enjoyable while you're distracted with a chore and vice versa okay now that i made myself free time i'm going to read some bible and i'm going to think about future video ideas the grind never stops but if you have some free time right now and you're not grinding then you can potentially watch this video over here where i asked 100 self-improvement youtubers for their best advice the video is packed with value so i would recommend watching it just click over here